in this video we are going to see the use case of transaction oy 17 so if i go to the transaction oy 17 it will show me uh, all the countries which are listed here so currently i can see around 249 countries so we'll go here and just put india uh, and when i double click on it so it shows me up the length and the postal code is six character length and the bank length uh, should be around 15 character and the length of the bank should be around uh, 11 characters so let's see uh, first we'll understand like uh, what is the use case of the bank here and the 11 character so if i go to fi01 and for country india uh, let's say I will give you a give a banky that is like uh, SBI zero zero one two zero zero three four five. So this is a banky, and uh, how many total characters? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. 10, 11, 12. So I'm taking total 12 characters here. And when I press enter, so it says that uh, it's allowed only 11 characters. So if I try to just reduce one character here, it will allow me to create a bank key with 11 characters and whatever the important fields are there, I will provide and I can save this one. Now let's see again what if i change the oy 70 transactions we'll go to oy 17 press enter and we'll go to position and go to country india double click on it so let's change this to timing uh, let's change this to seven characters and say this one Okay, so then now we'll go to uh, transaction again, FI01. And now we'll try to put a SBI1234 and one more, uh, two more digits. So here it will give me an error of seven characters. So it should be allowing only seven characters and uh, uh, more than that, it will not allow. Okay, so if I put seven characters, so it will take me inside and we can put all the information of the bank here and we can do it. Again, uh, I will go back and I will show one more importance of that particular transaction, OY17. Go to position, click on India. Okay, now I said like seven characters. So here the maximum length without gaps and spaces is there, right? So I will change the settings to. So there are a few settings which we have here. So I will change that settings to maximum value length numeric. So I will use the second maximum value length numeric without gaps. So I will use the option second and I will save this one. We'll go to FI01 again. So earlier it was taking SBI0012, right? Now let's try to create this one. So what it is saying that uh, bank key SBI must contain only numbers. So let me put numbers here instead of uh, SBI. So it will take. So this is the importance uh, rule. The transaction key OY17 will make in the bank key creation. So I will put the transactions as it is. Uh, it was there earlier. So let's go and change it to 11. 
and uh, this to one and we'll save it back. Now let's see uh, the postal code length for India is showing us six digits. Okay. Go to transaction code and SC16N or maybe I will go to FBL1N and let's execute for company code Tata Motors US. So this is my uh, vendor, control C. We'll go to vendor BP. And double click on it. So here uh, I have given the length. So for US, right? So for US, I have shown as a five uh, digit postal code. Now we'll see for US, what is the maximum length it's allowed? So we'll go to transaction. Yeah, and there is a lot of external uh, disturbance today. So not an issue. Uh, we'll continue. O Y seventeen. And here for US, we'll see postal code. So for US, it is saying that uh, total 10 digit uh, postal code and check rule is applied here. <clears throat> Let's go to BP start double click on it and here we'll try to edit it and let's put the number five <clears throat> six seven eight nine ten and save it so must have the postal code is must be in the sixth place after the postal code dash okay let's put dash after sixth place and press enter uh, uh i find be in the sixth place of the postal code okay so let's put So it's taking the value and save it. So this is how it has uh, taken the, uh, sorry for the external disturbance for today. Uh, yeah. Uh, so, so it has taken the 10 digits postal code. Now let's change that to six digits. We'll go to transaction code. OY17 for country US. So I will change the postal code to six digits and save. We'll go to transaction slash and BP. Again, for the same vendor. So if you scroll down, so earlier we have given five, six digits, right? So let's say uh, I will give six digit as iPhone and zero eight and save it. So here we have given total uh, eight characters and let's try to save this one. So it's saying that six characters are only allowed.
so let me uh, do this way let's put six here and save this one yeah so after uh, six the postal code should must have length of five or a ten so this is a standard uh, thing which uh, us will always apply either they take a uh, five characters or a uh, uh, ten characters so this is the way we can enter uh, if I try to add uh, two more fields, then again I will get an error saying that only six characters are allowed. Okay, so I will stop the recording here. I will continue again.